What is up guys, Austin awesome Nurture here and today we're doing an unboxing of the new Geek Fuel for this month. And so as you can see, this box is a lot bigger than their uh, normal boxes are. But we really, or usually really enjoy the Geek Fuel, so hopefully this one, with it being bigger and everything, will have some really awesome items coming out of it. So, let's see if I can get open, oh my goodness. There we go, okay. Um, so, of course, right on top we have our magazine, which we will look at, even though there's usually not spoilers. Um, but we'll look at that in a second. So, I can see why the box is so big right away, and this is kind of cool. We got in giant-sized Dorbs, the Dorbs XL, and we got a Rocket Raccoon. And, of course, obviously there was Groot as a possibility, or at least I assume you could possibly get Groot. Um, but we got Rocket, so we'll go ahead and pop him out of the box here, just to get a better look. We probably have this rocket or yeah rocket in a, a normal size probably right yeah yeah we do and so now we have him in a giant oversized it's like a big statue thing now that we have look how giant raccoon rocket is he looks so cool but this is i believe from yeah the first guardians of the galaxy so it is kind of old so it's probably they got like extra somewhere or something and got a hold of him uh but obviously we have um rocket with this somewhat smiley face usually the dorbs have a smiley face on it with their eyes closed and then they have big round head a uh, weird shaped body they kind of remind me like uh those old toys or whatever <laughs> and then of course rocket has his tail coming off um he doesn't have any guns or anything which would have been cool um but there we have the dorbs xl giant rocket which is cool so sit that aside uh next up we have our shirt which looks like it is a wonder woman shirt and so here we have Wonder Woman. So this is, of course, from the Wonder Woman movie. So we have, oh, you can, or at least it looks like the Gal Gadot Wonder Woman. And she has, yeah, like her um, tiara there on. And so, yeah, it's just a Wonder Woman picture there, which um, isn't bad. I mean, like I said, it's, uh, I feel a little weird wearing Wonder Woman shirts, but I think it's cool, so I'll probably still wear it anyways, if it fits. And so that, that's a really cool logo. I like the, that and the colors and everything. I think it looks really cool. So that is a good shirt. And to go along with that, we have, we'll just go ahead and skip to usually save for the end. But we have our pin for the month. And this is a Wonder Woman, or we got Wonder Woman at least. And it says, um, Wonder Fuel is the name of this one. And on the back, it shows there's other Justice League characters you could get. So obviously Superman, Batman, we got the Wonder Woman, Cy Cyborg, Flash, and Aquaman there. And it looks like, yeah, Aquaman was the rare. And so it's got some powers there, of course, related to it being like the little car guy um, thing. So that's just, I like the pin. Her face looks really weird. Though. All their faces look weird, but um, it's still kind of cool. Then next up, we have a um, luggage tag thing, which isn't very useful but it's the um, back to the future license plate so the outer time license plate there um, I probably won't open it because we'll just probably um, do something with it but yeah it's a luggage tag we don't travel so we, we don't need luggage tags for anything um, but I think it looks cool and it definitely looks just like the license plate from back to the future so that's kind of cool and it looks like our last actual item in the box is our steam code for the month and so we have space jacked as the um, game for this month. Again, still never played any of these games. This one looks kind of cool, though. Got a bunch of bunch of aliens in there. Like, you're possibly some doctors that shoot some aliens or something. Because I see a doctor with a gun. So that's, um, I need to check those out. I keep forgetting to. And then we, so we have our card with, oh, wow. Uh, with all the items in it. So let's look at this. So, of course, there on the front we have our Wonder Woman shirt that we got. And then on the back here we have, so the Dorbs XL, so we got Rocket, and so you could have got Rocket or Groot, Ant-Man, Robin, Big Daddy from Bioshock, or the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. So that's cool. So I would have liked uh, Groot, Ant-Man, or Robin possibly, um, but Rocket's fine too. He's close to Groot. Um, so got that, so that's awesome. Then we got our epic enamel pins, and we got Wonder Woman, of course, got all the same characters that we saw in the back. The Space Jack Steam game, and then the Out of Time Back to the Future license plate ID tag. Um, so let's look in the book here real quick. So we have the Night King, of course, from um, Game of Thrones there. We got our pins, which we got, of course, a little thing for George A. Romero since he passed away recently. Creative Night of Living Dead. Oh, the Super Nintendo NES Classic thing that people 
haven't been able to get uh, Game of Thrones, a little thing on the Space Jet game. Ooh, the ultimate. I love looking at these geek guide things because they show a bunch of cool items. Like, look at that Harry Potter um, train there. That looks awesome. Then we got our pictures for, oh my gosh, we, we're in the thing. I swear, every time they take a picture, <laughs> take our picture, it's so, such a weird picture. But we are the, down there in the bottom right here. <laughs> and they always do just like a super close-up on my face, and I don't know why. They can't just take like a normal picture or something. But this is our second time being in the book, so that's really cool. And of course, it's there with the um, Thundercats pin, which we thought was awesome from that month. Um, but Burr, what was your favorite item out of this box? Uh, the Dorbs XL. Yeah, I'd probably say that's mine. The um, box, obviously, with this is why it was so much bigger. I mean, the price didn't change or anything, so it's not like we got supposed to get more value out of it, even though these, you know, are more expensive than just a normal size Dorb. Um, but yeah, this will probably be my favorite, too. I not wasn't too impressed with the other items, um, but this, yeah, Giant Dorbs is probably my favorite, too, out of this box. But that's going to be it for this unboxing, so if you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up, leave any comments you have down below, and hit the red subscribe button to see more, and we'll see you next time.